Hi guys and welcome to Medronics. From today we start our official testing for already existing user. They already have an account on Medronics and because of this I want to show you today how you can create an API on the exchange and how you save this exchange, uh, how you save this API correctly into Medronics. First of all, what is Medronics? Medronics is a half automatic trading tool and our slogan is analyze like a human, trade like a robot. So we analyze first exactly on the market what we want to do, what is our target, which coins did we want and then Medronics supports you to reach your targets and to get the coins that you want in your wallet. For this we have special options but we can or we will talk later more in detail what are special for Medronics, what is special for the trading, what can I do in my account. So today I want to just show you or in this video I just want to show you what is how to set up a new API key and then step by step with short videos you will get all the information about Medronics. We can click here on start now and then we will come to this page and first of all we need to forget password. So I already have prepared here my email account and I also logged in into my Binance account because here we need to create the API later. Okay, so first we need to enter here our password that we want to recover. So if you have already an account then you can uh, make this. If you not, then you need to create a new account. So now we get the reset password. Reset. Now we have to set up a new password and reset. Okay, now we can log in here. So we enter our mail again and our password and log in. Okay. Welcome to Medronics. This is now the first step and now you see here on the in the menu that we have here the menu my exchange and here we can save the API. Now let's go ahead we need to go we need to log in into our Binance account or the account you want to uh, you want to connect with Medronics so it doesn't matter um, it's nearly everywhere the same. So we create here a new API and then I have to set a label. So if you use several softwares and tools what you connect with your trading account, then create for every software an own API. And then here you can uh, set a label and you just this is just a name that you can give the API key that you remind, okay, if you want to delete it, that this is the API key with this software and now I don't need it anymore. So we create here this API key. So here we get the... And here we need to enter our second factor code. Submit. Exactly. And then we have create here a new API key. Then you have to go here to edit restriction and you need to enable spot and margin trading. This is very important and please do this before you save the API key. So again we need another okay submitted. Now we are copy here the API key. We're going back to Metronics, Binance. We copy this also and connect. Okay, now we need to wait until the timer is gone and then we will see if we have done everything correctly. Yes, so the API is now connected. You will see here an expiration date and but uh, I have to tell you on, on this uh, in this video for Maxi Global you don't will see an expiration date so far because they don't provide it right now over API. 
So the most important thing is here that you are connected. So if you are connected, we have checked in the background that your API is open for trading and uh, also for reading. Yes, if there is some problem, you will see here an error. And for Binance, we see now here it is connected. The expiration date is here the 22th of uh, December. And yes, we don't have any error and now we can start trading. But more about this in the next video.